How would the European Union respond should Brexit become a reality after this Thursday's referendum in the UK? The European Commission president spoke to Euronews in Athens about that and the other major issues facing the EU today. Mr President, welcome to Greece, welcome to Euronews. These days the eyes of Europe are fixed on Britain. If the British finally decide to leave the EU, how damaging this may be both to the EU and to Britain? I hope that the British uh, will be let by common sense, because common sense is a British virtue. Uh, so I hope that uh, uh, Brexit uh, will not be the result of uh, the referendum. But if Brexit uh, would be the result of the referendum, this would both harm the European Union and uh, Britain. Without Britain, the European Union would no longer be complete. And uh, without the British pragmatism, the down-to-earth, the no-nonsense approach, the British very often uh, approving the European Union would not change its real nature, but uh, there would be a missing element. Let's come to Greece now. Almost a year ago, Greece was on the verge of uh, leaving the Euro. In the months that have passed since then, what has changed and to what extent uh, the EU is satisfied with the pace of the reforms taking place in the Greek economy? I, I was uh, fiercely fighting uh, for the uh, remain of Greece in the Euro area because there too the European Union and the Euro area would not be complete without uh, our Greek uh, friends. What did change? Something has changed because uh, since the summer of last year, 2015, nobody is seriously advocating the Brexit. And this is due to the fact that uh, we, have, we were able, and the Greek authorities and uh, the uh, authorities of the Euro area, to conclude the deal. And this deal is respected by both sides. So you are satisfied with the pace of the reform? I'm never satisfied with the pace of uh, reforms in none of the uh, 19 countries of the, European, uh, of the Euro area, but Greece is undertaking huge efforts. And I know that these efforts are seen by many, many Greeks, mainly by the poorest part of the Greek society, as being uh, unjust. And I know that uh, together the Greek uh, government and uh, the uh, Euro area uh, policy makers are putting uh, a huge responsibility on the shoulders of each and every of the Greek uh, citizens. And I'm admiring the Greeks uh, for the way they are dealing with this uh, uh, problem. So I'm not satisfied, but I'm more satisfied, I thought I could be satisfied in summer 2015.